The following segment is sponsored by Rosetta Stone, The Vitamin Shop, Adobe Express, and Garmin. Each Valentine's Day, the challenge is to find a unique gift that expresses feelings of love. Here with some timely suggestions is shopping expert Claudia Lambana. Welcome to the show, Claudia. Thanks for having me back. I'm happy to be here. Of course. So what kind of gifts are trending this year? You know, the theme for 2024 is really memorable and meaningful. So it's like, how do we get there? We're going to be spending more than $14 billion as consumers in America on Valentine's Day. So let's step away from the candy and the flowers and maybe pick out some gifts that are a little bit more special. All right. So speaking of special, what is a special or unique gift that can last a lifetime? I really like this idea for couples or, you know, friends who maybe want to travel together. And this is a gift of learning a new language with Rosetta Stone. Now, Rosetta Stone really is a great way to give a meaningful experience to that special someone. And they have a lifetime unlimited subscription where you can learn up to 25 different languages. That lifetime subscription right now is 50% off, so it's under $200 for the gift of 25 different languages. You will never run out of ways to say, I love you. So loving this idea for something different and really useful, a new skill of learning a new language. I love that, the gift of conversation. Do you have any ideas for personal help? Yes, you know, it's the beginning of the year. A lot of us are really health conscious, and this is something that you can carry with you throughout the entire year, not just right now where we're so hyper-focused on health. And this is Mary Ruth's Organics. They have a unique gift to express affection in a health-conscious way. It's their new liquid multivitamins. These are best sellers already. They're available in delicious flavors, including Coconut Dream and Peach Mango. These are vegan and sugar-free. Again, best sellers. They've got different formulas, including hair growth, uh, nighttime. So really a good idea for the health conscious person in your life. And these are available at the vitamin shop or vitaminshop.com, which is the leading destination for lifelong wellness solutions. So loving this for the health conscious person in your life. Perfect. Okay. What's a special way to create a memorable gift? I like something that, you know, is heartfelt. A lot of times a card can express that, but we're going to up-level that this year with Adobe Express, where you can make and create unique cards, but not just cards. You can make videos or even social media content for your Valentine or maybe even for your Galentines this year. You can choose from thousands of beautifully designed templates to spread the love. It's really a perfect way to kind of flex your creative skills, maybe even impress a crush. They're even using AI now to help you create some cool, unique designs so a great idea for something that you can personalize and will also be you know something more heartfelt I think absolutely okay we all know someone who loves tech so what is a hot tech gift suggestion Yes, I feel like we all kind of love our tech and we're all attached <laughs> to it. I think wearables are still wildly popular for me this year. It's going to be the Garmin Venue 3 GPS smartwatch. Now, this thing packs so much punch. You can reach your health and fitness goals with the Garmin Venue 3. It's got extensive fitness insights. It'll even track your sleep. It has a beautiful, vibrant, and uh, AMOLED touchscreen display. It's got a 10-day battery life. You can pair it with your smartphone to take and receive calls. It also has more than 30 built-in sports apps. So the Venue 3 from Garmin is really like a fitness coach right on your wrist. And Perfect. best of all for Valentine's Day, we've got $50 off of the Venue 3 from Garmin. Perfect. Claudia, all these gifts, everyone is going to love everything that you mentioned. Thank you so much for being with us and happy Valentine's Day. You bet.